My name is Baba Bertha and I'm here to introduce you to the awakening where the granddaughter takes you Oh, what's that flying at me? I'm always having things flying at me. Did you see that? Oh, that sign, it flew at me. Did you not see it? I didn't imagine it, did I? Anyway, uh, the granddaughter is here to take you from the dark into the light. That's what the awakening is. And I've got a nice uh, orange towel on today. She said it makes me more creative. So there you go. Anyway, enjoy the awakening. Do this. She wants me to tell you to do this and to click the bell underneath. Uh, I'm doing this because um, I want to put out the message like uh, Charlie Wood's little lad, Justin. I'm sorry if I'm not as, uh, as sweet as he is, but there you go. I'm doing my best. I'm Baba Berta and I'm the grandmother. And please enjoy my show as well. Baba Berta show coming today on uh, Moving On TV. Please subscribe, Moving On TV community. Oh, it's... it's Guys, welcome to The Awakening. <clears throat> 96. Today, after the blowout yesterday, um, I've done nothing. Um, I've just got up. I think it's six o'clock. I don't really care. <laughs> but I've been lying in bed just literally saying I'm powerless. That's it. I'm powerless. I'm powerless. I'm powerless. I'm powerless. That's it. I can't do anything. I'm powerless over the world. I'm powerless over the way I live. I'm powerless over my emotions. I'm powerless over um, the people in my life or the people that aren't in my life. I'm powerless in the people that aren't in my life. I'm powerless in those that were here. I'm powerless in those that aren't here. I'm powerless on what's coming. I'm powerless on what's not coming. I'm powerless over what other people are saying. I'm powerless over what people aren't, everything. I'm just powerless. There, I have absolutely no control now over life. And that's a good place to be. Let me tell you why. Because when you say you're powerless, then you can start to realize as a human being, I can do nothing now. As a human being on my own, uh, this whatever this flesh and blood is that's it I'm powerless over what's coming what's going what's happening what ha I don't know anything I'm powerless and it's a good place to be and because that's the 12 steps and it's a good place to start okay like starting from the very beginning very good place to start do re mi now, why does that work? The 12 steps work. Alcoholics Anonymous, Emotions Anonymous, Codependency, they work. There's a reason why they work. Because the minute you admit that you can't do anything, that you're too, this is too powerful for you, the madness, the lies, the, 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 the chaos, the confusion, the fear, the helplessness, the letdowns, everything, the pain, the suffering. The minute you admit that you're powerless over drink, powerless over people, powerless over your emotions, that's when you can stop, you stop, you stop. And you find a way to hand it over to something that may know better than you, which over the years I've seen it work when you surrender. I, you can call this surrender when your life means nothing anymore, when you don't want to get up, when you can't be bothered to work, when you've got nowhere to go and no one to see, uh, where you just feel like your life just literally has come to a point where you don't care what happens to you anymore. You went now. So that's total surrender. It's the same as when you want to give up drinking. The minute you say I'm powerless over drink, then you're giving an opportunity to your higher power to come in. The minute you say you're powerless over uh, people 
uh, you're admitting you don't know what to do, you're giving an opportunity for a higher power to come in. The minute you say I'm powerless over food, you don't know what to do when you're around food, you, you don't want to eat at all, or you want to eat too much, or there's no balance, you're giving an opportunity to a higher power to come in. The minute you feel that you're powerless with everything that's going on in the world, the cruelty, the madness, the sick, the loony bin that we live in, which I am, you admit you're powerless, it means you're giving an opportunity for a higher power to come in. But that's it today. Admit powerlessness. It feels easier when you say I'm powerless. You don't cry and scream and shout and fight because you are saying, you know what? I'm powerless. There's nothing I can do. And I'm just going to say that I'm powerless. I'm powerless. And let that higher power inside you. And some of you call God, some of you call spirit, some of you call whatever you call it to come in. And that's it. So for today, admit powerlessness. And that's what I'm doing. I'm asking now for that higher power to come in. And the higher power today said to me, just feel it. Just feel powerless. Don't, don't cry anymore. Don't go on social media. Don't talk to anyone. Because it's just going to push you further and further. People don't think what they say. They don't even seem to care what they say. They trigger people and they have no emotions or the empathy or, and, and maybe I do the same now because I'm powerless, all right? So now there's an opportunity for a higher power to come in. So I'm going to do a how to stay sane in the crazy world card, which are the cards that I channeled and I'm powerless over the fact that no one buys them ever. <laughs> How does they say in the crazy world? I think I've sold one pack in the last few years. Right. But I'm powerless over it. Powerless. Okay. May it cheer yourself. Today is your time, my friend. You're always giving to others. Now is your time to take something back. When we don't take some love back, then we will suffer. After all, it all starts with us and we have to look after ourselves so we can give more to those we love. So today, as you chose this card, make a list of things you enjoy. The smallest may be to have a nice bath, read a book or eat your favorite meal. Even a little chocolate is good. Don't cut out the things you love, you will crave them. Use common sense though, don't overindulge too much. To me, a wonderful salad is much more exciting and tasty. So Self-nurture, my friend. Today, I'll give myself nurturing by listing the things I enjoy doing. Trying to do at least one. There you go. That's it. Nothing else, just nurture yourself. I'm powerless. All I can do is nurture myself, so I stayed in bed. I might go back to bed after this and I'll get up again for a week. At the moment, that's all I want to do, sleep and forget, sleep and forget. That's it, let go completely, sleep and forget. I'm powerless. Hope you can have a powerless day today, admitting you're powerless is okay. Feeling, I don't know what to do, I haven't got a clue and ask that higher power to come in. That higher power could be, as I say, God. Nurturing yourself could be your higher power today. Sleeping, your sleep. That higher power could be different things to you. It could be, if you're lucky, a hug from someone who loves you. Or it could just be hugging yourself, which I have to do today. The higher power could be to get on moving on TV and try to do a positive program now with Mike Shinton. The higher power could be to cuddle your animals or to go into nature. 
Nature could be your higher power. So you come to believe that a power greater than yourself can restore you to sanity and balance. Once you're powerless, came to believe a power greater than myself can restore me to balance. The minute the mind starts to show you all the pain and the suffering and you say, I'm powerless. I'm teaching you the 12 steps here. It's nothing new. It's very easy. I'm powerless. I want to get angry, I want to scream, I want to shout. I'm powerless. I can't be bothered, I'm powerless. I came to believe a power greater than myself can help restore me to sanity. I tried to do the three, the first three steps at the same time because they go together as far as I'm concerned. So I admit I'm powerless. Then I admit that there could be a power greater than myself because I've seen it work in life. I've seen it work in life sometimes so i hand it over i came to believe that it's there this power greater than myself and then i made a conscious decision to hand everything over to it and that's it you take it you take it nature you take it god you take it the flower you take it uh, moving on tv you take it that screen you take it that light and if people think I'm promoting the Maltese claws because I've got to cover up a bit of a dirty part of the window because that's all I've got at the moment to cover it up with, then please get off moving on TV because I'm powerless over your madness and your nonsense. If I'm cabal, <laughs> that's hilarious. Is that why I'm living in total poverty with no one? <laughs> yeah, okay. Right, I'm powerless. And as I say, I'm powerless over you lunatics. And I'm powerless over everything else. And today, I'm hugging myself because I'm powerless. I came to believe that power greater than myself is telling me to hug me. As there's no one else to hug me. I made a conscious decision to hand today what's left of it over to that higher power. And every time I feel powerlessness, I'll do the same. So that's the awakening for today. I'm coming next. As I say, I'm going to do a positive talk, a positive program with Mike Shinton about someone who's feeling really peaceful. And I don't understand how. So that's what we're going to try and figure out today. Try and get some good news on for a change and see what Mike has got to say about anything good that might be happening or anything good that might be coming towards us. I love me and I love you. And if you want to be powerless with me, you know where I am. That's up to you. I love you. Take care. No choice. Okay, so continuation to the awakening. <laughs> I'm powerless because I can't do my interview. Personally, can't do it at the moment. So there we go. I feel completely let down again. Completely. <laughs> this is all I get. I'm powerless. I'm powerless. Powerless. I want to cry, I want to emote, I wanted some positivity to give you guys. I can't, I can't give you positivity because I don't have anything to give you at the moment. All I can give you is what I've got. And all I can give you is a little bit, try to help you a little bit today by admitting that there's nothing I can do to make you feel better, to make myself feel better. Nothing. I suppose my higher power would say, don't get too hungry, so eat. Don't get too angry, how is that possible? <laughs> 